And moving on, ice skating and ice hockey are among the sports that are gradually gaining popularity in the country. But the growth has not been as steady as expected due to the lack of training facilities. Robinson Okenye paid a visit to the ice skating instructors in Nairobi and filed the following report. Winter games are events that Kenyans follow on international media, mainly because Kenya lies on the equator and does not experience winter. However, the Panari Sky Center ice rink has been offering Kenyans the chance to experience the joy of winter games, especially ice skating for almost a decade, with youngsters being the biggest beneficiaries. So many people think this is meant for white people. I'm happy that it's catching up. Many people are getting to know the basics. And currently, we have a lot of people who know how to do it. It's just the same, no different ice skating and the roller ones. It's, it's, it's so much fun that you cannot believe it. Ben Azegere, who owned his trade in Norway, feels Kenya has the potential to shine in the sport. But the biggest undoing is the lack of exposure due to the limited number of ice rinks in Africa. There are very few in the continent. This being one of them in East and Central Africa. So it becomes a challenge to organize a continental event. Ice hockey is among the games that have been appealing to a number of skaters and the instructor feels the youngsters have what it takes to join the best ice hockey leagues in the world. All they need is an opportunity and we are trying to nurture that talent. We, they have a lot of potential. So we would love to see in future some of the young talents playing in the NHL. With the Panari Ice Rink being the only one in East and Central Africa, the country will host an African Skating Championship in July this year for Kenyan teams to test themselves against African opponents. Ice hockey and ice skating may be one of the sports that are not popular in the country. But with the sport starting to take shape in the country, it is the hope and dream of the kids that are taking part in this competition that one day the NHL may come calling. Robinson Okenye, KTN Sports.